Some plants like cucumber, zucchini, and squash have both male and female flowers. Pollen from the male flower must be transported to the ovary on the female flower, which looks like a miniature fruit right there. This usually occurs courtesy of bees and other pollinating insects, but can easily be achieved by hand pollination. Many gardeners experience concern over the plant's lack of female flowers. So here I'm gonna give you five reasons why cucumber plants might not have female flowers. Reason number one will be male flowers have the advantage. In the garden, varieties of plants that have male and female blossoms will start producing male flowers first. That way they are gonna cover all the stems with pollen and attract pollinators in preparation for reproduction. In about two weeks, the plant is still gonna start giving you female flowers. And when the plant matures completely, it's gonna give you even more male and female flowers, making sure you're gonna have lots of cucumbers in the future. Reason number two, males outnumber females. The male flowers will always outnumber the female flowers, making sure there's gonna be enough pollen to go around. For the record, there are exceptions to the rule. Okay, some varieties of cucumbers are every plant developed by scientists to produce only female flowers. But these flowers will include the pollen from the male flowers already. After all, it takes two to tango, right? Another variety of cucumbers will produce fruit without pollination. Uh, these seeds are purchased usually by big operations, or that will be a good choice for your green garden. Reason number three, poor nutrition. If you have male blossoms and no female blossoms, it's possible that your plant is not getting the right nutrition. It takes more energy for your plant to produce female flowers. So make sure you fertilize your plant accordingly. What's more is that container gardens tend to lose um, nutrition quicker than traditional gardens because over time it drains out with the water out of the container. Reason number four guys, lack of sun! Yes, another reason why your plant might not be producing female blossoms is because it's not receiving enough sunlight. Fruit bearing plants need at least six hours of sunlight every day. And the great thing about container plants is that you can relocate them to a sunnier location. Reason number five, guys, stress. Hey, no one does well under stress and plants are no exception. Environmental conditions such as um, improper watering, excessive heat, insect uh, damage, or even a cold snap can stress your plan and then they will stop producing female flowers. Do what you can to alleviate stressful conditions and you should see female flowers before too long. Each of these five reasons can easily be addressed. That way your plant will be happy and will produce female flowers and many fruits all season long.